Welcome back to Final Let's Play Final Fantasy. Uh, we're gonna see what's in this cave now that we looked at the other ones. We got upgraded in the last one. We uh, have new sprites and new stats. Fred's the clear defensive winner. I am curious about what that 70% dodge rate would be like, but it's probably not worth it. It basically just means it, it gives us enough of an upgrade so that our dodge is roughly the same as it was before, except we get to have more defense. Wow. Are these guys... not Cardassians. Are these guys like Ferengi? I'm still wondering if these are the same species of dragon. Well, I say the same species. The other, those other dragons, they can be various different kinds of elements. They can be fire and zombies and, uh... I looked at this one alright, right? Yeah, I think I looked at this one and then on the one on the left. And then the third one is the most recent one, the one up there, because I looked at this one, because I walked across the Mars. Anyway, so you can have various different kinds of dragon, uh, so that they, they may or may not actually be considered the same species. I'm not quite sure about that. Ah, oh, there it is. We just need to go to the right. Oh, the other thing I forgot to do, he can equip different, uh, swords. I already looked at the, uh, uh, I already looked at the equipment, but I didn't look at the swords. So I should take a look at that. One damage. I gotta say, that's not quite as impressive a punch uh, as impressive a looking a punch as it did before. It looks like he's not really throwing the punch as hard. Okay, so, uh, he can equip that. And he can equip a bunch of other stuff, too, that Ice is holding on to, because he can't do anything else with it other than that. He can equip the... Oh, wait. So he can equip the, uh, the flame, ice, and defense. And defense has, doesn't have sword bite, but it might be because it's too long, like Falcon, now that I think about it. Falchion, rather. There might be too many, uh, characters. On the other hand, flame is, what, five characters? One, two, three, four, five. And it says sword next to it, but saber is one, two, three, four, five. But it doesn't. But maybe the saber isn't considered a sword, I don't know. So yeah, uh, he was originally at the Coral, so let's look at his attack and hit. That's 31 and 60. 31, 60. That's 38, 65. I think the other one's going to be the same. What was it, 38, 65? No, it's 70. 46. No, wait, 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 wait. 4170. Now I gotta check the other one again. Uh, 4170. So yeah, that one's obviously better. But let's see what defense is. That's 4280. So, yeah, obviously, uh, defense, for whatever reason it's called defense, is his best weapon. Uh, so his hit percent's 80, and his is 65. Uh, I, I kinda got the impression that that affects, uh, how often you hit your attack with. But, uh, that seems a little weird. It seems more like it should be accuracy, but maybe it's both. 60 gold, that's okay. 9,500, that's pretty good. 2,750. And 1,520. Then I am impressed. 
look at his silly uh, ribbon. What do you call that? Well, anyway, it's standing up for some reason. It's like why is it why is it upward like that? How does that make sense? Uh oh, we got bones that we can walk on, like in the witch's house. Well, we can definitely get those other spells now. Starting with exit and warp. That'll be really good. Although, now I'm a lot less afraid of stuff, so maybe we don't even need to run away anymore. Uh, although I don't want to be too cocky. Okay, so that's... Oh, I, I, I should have just gone to the right, and then I would have been where I should have been. Oh, we can get closer than that. I wonder if this is where we're supposed to be introduced to the dragons. them, I tend to just use uh, tents because they're more economic, but, oh, it's soft. Yeah, there was basically just money in these chests, but that's okay. I think you usually only find money in, like, town chests. So yeah, I'm gonna go f to that vampire town. I don't know why I call it the Vampire Town. I mean, it was attacked by a vampire, but that's about as much of an association with vampires as it is. Uh, I'll do that before looking into those, going back to that town to get the magic there. Just because I'd rather have, well, uh, I guess it's not necessarily the best spell, because the one that the White Wizard has is technically better. Okay, I think I have to go to the southern continents. That might be far enough. Well, I kind of associate it with being north, but it's really only north on the southern continents. So I actually really need to go south. Uh, I keep going and I don't see anything. across the world and didn't find him. Uh, let's see, that's the dwarf cave, I believe. Oh, I, that means we need to go further south, I think. Or maybe not. Where is this? I think I remember now. This is south of... Oh, is this the vampire town? calling it Vampire Town. It kind of looks like a vampire town. Because it's kind of dead looking and you have a broken down building and that's like vampires for some reason. Maybe it isn't this one. Let's look at the white magic real quick. Cure life harm heal too. Yeah, okay. Uh, I, was it level 3? It might be. Let's see. Ah, yes, warp. Well, we've gone... F Let's see, slow, fire three. We've gone long enough without Bane, so I guess we don't really need it. Alright, now we finally have that. Oops, that's not the right one. So, if I wanted to use it to equip to... Maybe not run away entirely. I mean, it's good as a backup to, uh... The white magic version. It's not as good, but, uh, and if I were to, well, I would use slow two against really strong enemies and bosses. Fire three is probably the one I would use the most of this, and, uh, so that's about all there is to say about that. I'd only need to worry about that overlapping with, uh, fire three. And let's see, where's the other one? Is it around here? No, 
this is like the first area. Oh, maybe it's in Crescent Lake. I think actually it is. This seems right. Soft exit. Excellent. Or excellent. Oops. I do, I do that again. I guess I associate that with looking at characters. I don't know. Okay, so now C has exit. So we can run away basically whenever we want to now. I tend to avoid using these two spells anyway, because they're so powerful. So if I ever really needed to, I can easily escape from any dungeon, so I feel a lot safer now. Out of my way. And then we have... Yeah, we have Quake, Stun, and Lit 3, so we have those all filled out. Uh, I think we have enough money for one of the level 7 or... <coughs> one of the level 7 black or white magic. Come to think of it... Okay, he, he still needs to level up before he gets any. I don't know if as soon as he evolves, let's say, he gains access to it, or if you have to get them with every level uh, necessarily. Um, like... If he's supposed to be able to use level 1 magic at level 20, but he can't do it because he was already level 21 and he can only get them with level ups, then he would get some available with every level up, but, uh, yeah, we'll just keep an eye on that, but the, the other cool thing about the ninja is he can use black magic, although obviously he can't use as many as the Black Maids can, and, uh, you know, he doesn't learn the spells, or the spell slots as quickly. So, uh, and then his intelligence, and that is, that's how much your magic does, at least in theory. I'm not so sure how that works exactly. Wait, maybe... When you do slow, that lowers their intelligence, but that doesn't, uh, clearly... Well, anyway. The long and short of it is, since his intelligence isn't as high, in theory that means his attacking magic isn't as high. Which would mean, uh, he might actually be... It would be better for him to do status inflicts in magic, or at least to do that more often. And I don't know if that's also affected by your hit percentage, but that might mean... Well, let's see. I've never seen a Black Magic attacking spell miss. I don't know if the accuracy... Maybe the, uh... Your accuracy affects the status inflicting magic spells, or maybe those are fixed percentages. If that's the case, well, it would still be an, o an okay idea to give him status Black Magic rather than actually attacking. Um, so we'll, uh, I guess we'll think about that later. All legends and prophecy will be fulfilled. I'm wondering if they have any updates for us. Let's see, we have earth and... I think we have earth and fire, and it's wind and water that we need. Water's obviously, uh, the one that's below the, where the submarine is. Each element's power focuses at the altar. Okay, that's the same. us on when we get orbs. It's not like whenever we make progress, it's only for the orbs. We must use forceful for just purposes. 
they aren't really telling us much different things. Much different things. Many different things. I think he's the only one who says anything different. I think so. I think that's something new. now. Uh, did I already get Ice 3? Yeah, we got Blind and Ice 3. That's in this place. Wait, did I already do this earlier? No, that's Brack. Uh, I don't think I'll get that right now. Okay, so he has hell and a rub, which means the other one is here, alright? Cure and harm, and we want cure. Oops. Hold on. I believe they have armor here. I think I have things to sell, too. silver, apparently. I hope I'm not being dumb. I don't think I am, though. Okay, what else don't we need? Okay, he has those equipped. The fire and ice. He can equip a helmet whenever we get around to that. That doesn't seem entirely necessary anymore, though. And... <laughs> we can sell those gloves. We'll keep the Zeus. Uh, we'll keep the cap. Gloves and silver. Gloves. We can sell that cap. Okay. So gloves and cap. That's not a bunch, but may as well get rid of them. Like this isn't enough to. Uh... Why is it that we don't? Do the gloves replace the shield? Is that what it is? Or they're they're overridden with each other? Oh, we also don't need the buckler. I don't think. But yeah, it's almost more about... Oh, that's only worth two. Don't know why that is. But it's almost more about freeing up inventory space than anything else. Okay, so we got the... I don't think we need the coral in really. If we have defense, I don't know if we need ice or flame anymore. Like, we may as well sell all these older swords. Even though they seem cool. Uh... I mean, nobody else can use a sword except for Fred. I don't think. Not that we'd want to. Um... Oh, he can't even equip that. Ugh. So I think we can actually sell some of those. Uh, we had kind of a... We had... Uh, a couple long ones, so I think I'll actually just cut this one off at 20 minutes, and I'll just kind of decide what to sell, and then I'll buy the heal for, or, or the cure for, just off screen, 
And I think that'll be it for a while, because not only is my throat getting sore, I'm wanting to record a lot of these this week, since I didn't get much done this week for... Um, I, today's really the last day I can do anything, because it's one day, Wednesday, cause it, since I, and I work Thursday through Sunday this week, so it's kind of a... Uh, bummer. But then if I get more of these recorded this week, then I don't have to do them next week, which means I'll have more time to develop other things. Okay, so I'm just going to do all this, decide what to sell off screen. It feels wrong to sell some of these swords, because they were, they seemed like such good upgrades, but, uh, they probably are obsolete now, so I'll probably end up getting rid of most of these swords. Because it felt like, oh, we have a lot of swords to choose from. This one's going to be good at this situation, but this one's going to be good at another. Or, like, Rune, that's going to be good against magic people, because it attacks them directly or something. And then, Ware's good against the undead, but it really isn't like that. So, I'll just end up getting rid of most of these. I just want some more official confirmation. So, we'll do that in the next episode. Or, you know, it'll be done by then. Uh, see you then.